the heart. Starters for Green Line. Looks like both coaches sticking to the same starters from the last time these two teams met. Last matchup in the reinforced semifinals, they can't uh, risk any experiment on today's mm -hmm. lineup. They're really gonna uh, be serious and start with their solid starters. I'm prioritizing the rest and we see Benate Casemela, tuloy tuloy talaga. Hindi man sila nagpahinga between conferences. And let's get things started here. Banks Panaga with that first slide. Abil picked it up. Chance here for Signal to score first. Molina. Bernadette Pons. Bernadette Pons, you know, I remember very well. See Dory having an instant impact. The Signal HG Spiker scoring off that last point. Good defense by Molina there. Basas is picked up by Pons. Now showing off her defense. Taunton with a cross. <laughs> We talked about that hit over and over. Master it here at the Invitational Conference. Imagine she sees MJ Perez. And I think you, if Green Line has proven uh, something more in this uh, recent Key Enforced Conference, is that it's not solely the import. Because mm. that's the trend. Eh. Ah, okay, palakas tayo ng import. But. Good first ball from Pons, and that drop ball again. She has impeccable timing with these one-two plays. Signal needs a string of points. Good serve. The Mabao, easy over there. And Sess will go up. Atienza with the pickup. Oh, the cross court. And you know she intended that. <laughs> Michelle Gumabao, that was There's easy, no, uncontested, Gumabao. and an easy first set win. So let's see how how they learned in that uh, set number one. Oh, of course, Green Knight starting off with an ace, and as expected, the number one server. Probably had some uh, scouting activities mm. to study the tendencies of their opponents. Nabasa si Pons doon. Kayuna setting up Cesc Molina again. Painit the painit. Ishi lalong isip with the serve. Perfect pass from Pons. MJ is in the front. So is Staunton. And she finds that end zone, zone 6. Empty there for signal. So if you're signal, you kalang mo talagang alaga nitong kalabangan mo. Alam mo hindi din na uh, biro itong mga matchups <laughs> ng uh, signal at cream line. Kagaya ng uh, dig na yan ni Don, baka hindi ka tindig, hindi biro. Pero three out of the four matches that. Uh, and that's also what sets her apart, the frequency. We know that uh, all of these outside hitters can uh, do those combination plays, but the frequency, kung uh, gaano kadala sila ginagawa in sa cream line with her in the front yeah. line, that sets her apart. Oh, she's blocked this time, but ball's still good. Kayuna will reshuffle, giving it to Cesc Molina. That's a good choice. MG is going to have just a single blocker. Basas. Dug by Kyle Negrito. It's a broken play. Gumabo again. Block and outside. She knows that she says is the smaller of the blockers. <laughs> MJ Ooh. Perez with a wind-up. She wanted that point number 27. Kyle Atienza. Had a hard time with that. But Staunton will go up anyway. Here's a chance for Kayuna and MJ with the tip. Good read by Kyle. Staunton with a return. And another tip. Kyle Negrito too smart for that. Cut shot. Stopped by Doria. Where will MJ go? Kyle Atienza. Fantastic defense. Whoa! We'll talk about smart play. 
Kalimutan just mm. to be able to activate uh, the other players, the middles in particular, for them to be able to contribute. So the star of that second set was Erika Staunton who scored 13 points in that set two alone. And we start with a rally here. Must win third set for Signal HD. They keep the ball in play. Perez going deep and they're going to get a touch. If you're Signal, this is what you need to do to really learn as you go. You can't stop dahil na frustrate ka. Rather low, but still. Good effort by Katindi, who's really made the difference for Signal. And again, trick shot from Pons. Good read by the HD. So many options for Kyle Negrito, and it is Michelle Gumaba who manages her 11th point. They could at least activate Chin Chin Basas. Mm -hmm. Or si Riri, no? Pag siya nasa harap is the case now. You mentioned how Riri was able to score in the 20s in the past games. Kasi parang hindi na nagiging threat si Chin eh. Parang every time magsiset si Kayuna, naka-automatic na yung blockers on the outside hitters mm. and the, the middle. And that one escapes MJ Perez. Oh, she is about. really frustrated about that one. Good sir. But Bonds took care of that one. What a read by Katindig. Katindig was there again. Yep. And says Molina, bumalik ang bola. Buhay pa rin. Another chance here. Risa Sato is on the court. <laughs> and she scores right out of the bench. Right now, they have to focus on each and every point. They have to want this from each and every, starting from each and every point. They have to ignore any distractions and they have to have the confidence to execute. Back to the panel. Picking up here in the middle of this rally. Good save there by Ces Molina. Another chance here for Creamline to set up. Staunton figured something out. But this is a tight match. We know that none of these players would want to commit those errors. Oh, wow. Nice pick up there by Ces Molina. This is the biggest lead that Signal's enjoyed all game. Three points. Perez with a tip. Once again, we'll go. This time finding the hole. So six empty and empty points just... Hindi talaga pwedeng kumarap and more than any team, itong signal lang makaka-attest dyan. Oh, great pick up there by Katindig. And oh. Perez will send it over. A chance here for Creamline to set up. Combination attack almost. Dawn was there, just couldn't put it up. Big serve for Bernadette Pons, taken care of by Katindig. Creamline will set up. Staunton, picked up by Sess. MJ wants point number 24. No, 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 said Kyla Atienza. Perez again. This time, just really challenging Kyla Atienza every time. HD spikers, they just need to close out to extend this oh. set. And that's exactly what MJ Perez has in mind. The coaches mentioned earlier in the uh, pregame that they were out to really improve on their errors for Creamline and to learn how to close out for Signal. Mm -hmm. And nakikita natin that they are able to accomplish both. She scored 32 points against Signal that last time they met. While well, MJ Perez had 38. Oh. Good reaction there from Creamline. Galanza pushing it out to Pons. Pons likes the set, and she will get point number 13. Right now, we have Jel Kayuna with uh, her third to serve. She had a couple of aces, too. Good set. Another chance here. Jel will go to MJ again. Scrambling on the side of Creamline. Oh. That is outside. But touched last. By signal. Oh
Elba will go up, and she finds zone six. That was her target. Roofed Angie really well on that last sequence. Stockton, a good combination, but Chelka Yuna read it. That was a bit tight. And again! And we can agree that this isn't the first time. You can feel the pressure. Greenline just wanting to finish it off in four. Perez! Oh, solid block! And again, Kyle Grito. If you're dead, you're clearly gonna be frustrated <laughs> if that happens to you all throughout the game. Doria was stopped by Creamline. Fons will send it over! Oh, what do you call that? Ano bang klaseng palu yun? We saw a glimpse of Vanny Gandler who was brought in at the serve earlier. Good serve by Jell. There's a chance for Signal to set up. Perez goes! Great job by Kyla Atienza. Perez again! Good rebound. Perez one more time! What a block there. <laughs> Look at Pons with her defense. And you know, you gotta oh, hand it to Perez. Talagang being persistent there and not losing focus. Dahil... And Stonto and just a perfectly executed combination attack coming out of nowhere. Uh, receiver of the team. Jesus trying to score match point. Not quite yet. Molina going up. The block. Perez with a chase. Molina again is blocked there. Back row attack. Outside. Untouched by 